Hello, everybody. Welcome back to Radiology Number Twenty Four. And as I kept my promise, we're gonna keep this upload streak rolling. So let's get into it. Hello. If you remember from yesterday's video, we started talking about different types of fractures, and today we're gonna to continue on with that. Um, just as a note, if you want to pause here and take a quick note of how to read an x-ray, go ahead and do that. But I've already explained this part in some of my other videos. So if you're a little bit confused, feel free to check them out. Alright, so the x-ray image itself can kind of be um, guessed or predicted to be something to result with the arm over here. Now, specifically what's happened here, you can see is is not only is there the two bones that are kind of broken, fractured, right? But what we can also see is that one bone is protruding more closely towards the skin. This is what's called a compound fracture. This namely happens when the fracture of a bone kind of uh, brings itself up, like it projects itself towards the skin, and you can kind of visibly see it in a sense. So I'll show you another image to show you better representation. Now this one here is a lot, lot worse. Why? Because it deals with the legs. Now the legs are some of the longest bones, so it's very uh, hard if you fracture your leg bone. Now if we look over here, we can see that it might be the tibia or the fibula that's been broken. That's one of the leg bones. Um, we can see the bones actually protruding, and in this case, through the x-ray, we can actually see it coming outside the skin. If you can kind of see the outlines of the skin, you can see the outline edge of the bone kind of going outside. So that's what's called a compound fracture. And these compound fractures aren't easy to fix. It's not going to be as simple as doing a cast. Usually, there has to be some type of intervention taking place, and that's usually through uh, surgery that kind of put it back in place and then cast can kind of work over time and just take a really long time actually. A lot of, it might have to be some physical therapy done because it's just gone so bad. All right, hope you guys enjoyed this today's video and I'll see you on the next one. Bye-bye.